Observe the host of mankind. How are they wretched? Why? Because they are not free. Why? Because the giddy multitude are driven by the unpredictable must of their pleasures. And the sober few are bound by the inflexible lord of their duties. Between which slaveries there is nothing to choose. Would you be happy? Then learn to act freely. Would you act freely? Then learn to ignore those twin tyrants of appetite and conscience. Therefore, I counsel you, master, take papa the Turk to wife. Consider her picture once more, and as you do so, reflect upon my words. In youth, the panting slave pursues the fair evasive game. Then in cold affairs woos, wealth, office, or a name. Till old, dishonored, sick, downcast, and failing in his wits, in virtue's narrow cell, at last the withered boltsman sits. That man alone, that man alone, his fate fulfills. For he alone, for he alone is free, who chooses what to will, and wills his choices destiny. can foretell, no law his past explain, whom neither passion may compel, nor reason can restrain. 